again, it's Q&A Wednesday. Our message comes from Brian. Brian is from Albuquerque, New Mexico, and Brian writes, We are an older community and would love to go green, but we're really not sure how we can do this. Any suggestions? Well, Brian, this is the perfect time of year to ask this question because between the months of March and May, it's actually the Great American Cleanup sponsored by Keep America Beautiful. So we're going to share a few suggestions on how even an older community can go green. And really, it doesn't matter what kind of a community. These are little initiatives that anyone can do. So a couple of the fun ideas for either move-in gifts or renewal gifts are to give away the LED energy-efficient light bulbs. This gift is great because it keeps on giving. The savings that your residents will experience on their electric bill will go on for months and months. So a really good gift. Another idea is to give away the Eco Water Saver Shower Timer. And we found a great one at allinoneonline.com for as little as $4. They're really cute and they allow your residents to kind of be mindful of how long of showers they're taking. And it also will help them to remember to save a little bit on water. So two nice little gifts. And then if you don't offer individual recycling for every single unit, it still is a good idea to set up at least one station for recycling. Those that truly are green in your community will really appreciate that effort. Another idea is if you're doing ordering promotional materials, and maybe you don't do this all the time, but every once in a while you do, this time instead of ordering the traditional pens or tumblers or whatever it is, why not order the canvas tote bags with your logos? It's a great way to save and, and go a little bit green, and it's great to have your marketing material get legs and go all over the place. Your message will be definitely seen. Another idea is having a crafting party for the children. So now they can kind of do recycling and upcycling projects. Things that maybe were considered trash at one point can now turn into bird houses or bird feeders. The site that we found was RecycleGuys.org. They had some really good ideas for the kiddos. Now for the adults, we don't want to leave them out. Maybe consider hosting a resident swap or resident garage sale. So somebody's trash is another person's treasure, and this is a great way that residents can either sell their stuff or they can trade. And old things find new homes or they get repurposed into whole, completely other different things. It's a great way, again, and it's a great way for your residents to get to know each other. And then if you're currently printing your newsletter, that's a lot of paper each month that's being used. Why don't you ask your residents if they would be opposed to getting the newsletter via email? This will save a little bit on paper, and again, another simple way that you're showing you're going green. The last thing that I want to comment on is the idea of having a community garden. I love, love, love this idea. You could then even tie, in, tie it into cooking classes or hosting a demonstration and using the materials grown from the, your very own community garden. So it's really grassroots all the way. These are just a few ways, Brian, that you can go green, and we'd love to hear from everyone else. If you have some other green ideas, please share, and if you like it, like it, and we look forward to seeing you next week on our Wednesday Q&A. Thanks.